Hello, welcome to my channel. This is Sarah, and this is a coloring book review for Color Your Own Young Marvel by Scotty Young, and they are the Marvel superheroes um, while they were young children. Uh, most of them look to be around five or so um, as I flip through the book today. I did not um, go through every page, so I'm seeing this for the first time, most of it, with you guys as well. And I wanted to let you guys know uh, the cost. I've had a lot of people ask about the cost of each of the books that I've posted on here or the art supplies that I have on, on my um, YouTube channel. And this particular book um, you can buy off of Amazon for around $8. So I wanted to let you guys know that. So the dimensions of the book are seven and a half by eleven. So just just a bit smaller than a regular size of printer paper. Um, this is the front. This is a pretty thick book. Here is the spine, and this is the back. And it looks like just about every Marvel superhero that you could imagine is inside this book. This is a pretty neat, unique little book. So I'm going to go ahead and start the flip through now. Pages are perforated and it is glue bound. So inside the front flap you'll have a nice colored version of the superheroes. I'm not sure if this page is inside the book or if it's just an example or what's going on there because I've not Flip through the whole book itself and then on the back cover you'll have um, just a little blurb about uh, different characters and stuff that you can get as a stand-up um, punch-out book back here so first page you have is the informational page and the artwork is done by Scotty Young Go go ahead and flip through this book. Like I said, the pages are perforated, which makes it really nice since they are one-sided. You can tear them out and use the markers on them without worrying about running the page on the back side since there is none. So that makes this nice. Because they are perforated, I'm going to try and zoom in a little bit. Or, I'm sorry, because they're one-sided. So you guys can get a closer look here. Maybe that's a little too close. There we go. So these are pretty cute designs overall. Um... There's lots of space for you to color. None of the designs are so detailed you're not going to have to worry about not being able to get your pencils in there, your markers in there to color the way you'd like to. Paper quality of this book feels like a higher quality paper printer copy paper kind of stuff. Um, so it, it's a bit thicker than your average printer paper, but um, it still is printer paper. I've not tried anything inside this book. I just got it today, and I've not tried coloring in it or anything. So I would assume... Um, because I have colored in a lot of different books with different paper qualities and stuff, I'm going to say that this book would be good for colored pencils, crayons, watercolor, if you're very, very careful with the water. That should work out just fine. And because it is one-sided, it would be fine for markers, alcohol and water-based markers both. As long as you tear out the page. I wouldn't use the markers inside the book unless you're tearing the page out. Um, you could also put uh, the blotter page between your pages. 
I mean, if you use a thick cardstock um, paper between the two pages, it should be fine for markers as well inside the book, so you don't have to tear it out if you don't want to. These are really cute pictures. I'm really enjoying this book so far. Having trouble turning the pages. I have to say that Thor is not as good looking in this book as he is in the movies. Just thought I'd throw that out there. This book would be good for your superhero connoisseur. Um, anybody who really likes superheroes, this would be great for. Um, because of the type of pictures they are and how they're drawn, this book would also be good for children, not just adults. Um, children would have a great time with this book. The children seem to be about five, six years old, um, how they're drawn inside here. That seems to be about the age of the kids in the book. I thought. So this is the picture that's inside the front cover right here. Um, it's just not colored. And that is it. There is no test page in this book. In the back, there's no index or anything like that. So this is your pretty basic coloring book. Very thick, very nicely done. I like the idea of young superheroes. I think that's kind of cool. And I hope you enjoyed this review. And again, this is Color Your Own Young Marvel by Scotty Young. And I had a request to give the ISBN number. So I'm going to zoom in on that here. And the retail price for this is $9.99 U.S. or $12.99 Canadian. Um, like I said, um, you can get this off of Amazon for about $8. And I hope that's helped everybody. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say the numbers of the ISBN out loud. So um, if you are the people that have been asking me about that, here is the information. The ISBN number is 9780 seven eight five one nine five 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 nine so i hope that helps and until next time happy coloring